It seems I can't get away from Kentucky. Who knew that this was such a strange place? This is not this week's video. We went to Bartow County in Georgia, USA after hearing about some of the most vicious murders that happened there. That will be uploaded on Friday. But I needed to get this out there. I saw another paranormal anomaly after editing last week's video. I wonder if you all caught it. Kentucky is really full of a lot of strange occurrences. Granted, who could have predicted that someone could combine herbs and spices to make chicken taste so good? Or that there would be so many people going missing every year in parts of Kentucky, especially in Clay and Leslie County. And boats breaking and sinking in the Ohio River for no apparent reasons. We only went there to shoot the locations of the missing folks and the sunken ships but while doing my final review of the video I just uploaded titled Something Powerful Pulled Them Under, something else caught my eye. Watch. Did you catch it? Watch again. Did you see it this time? I thought I was done with Kentucky. But I had to get this one off my mind and put it out there to see if anyone could explain this. As I said before, I am of the school where there is an explanation for everything. That was why I think I figured out what was making my phone sound different on and off Route 66. But for information purposes, I had to give all the research thoughts on the matter. Here go the UFO sightings. However, I left the cause of the sunken boats for you to reason out. Maybe it was gravity pull, like I said, nature, or maybe it was something else. You tell me. But this one I need help with. We thought maybe it was a car passing and there was a glass close by and it reflected off the wall. But then we saw that the wall was not reflective and there was no glass close by based on what I remember. The walls are concrete. And though the murals are painted, the paint is old and dry. Therefore, it could not reflect anything. And even if it could, the sun was not in the right place for that to happen. Then we considered that maybe it was a bird. So we played it again and found that birds don't fly that fast, nor do any insects we know of. See? But what threw us for a loop was when I slowed it down and listened. There was a sound. That thing made a sound. Not like any bird or insect and reflections don't emit sounds. Ladies and gentlemen, I don't believe in anything supernatural, though I love to write and watch horror stories, but this is giving me pause. Here is the video slowed to the lowest I can make it. My regular videos play at one. This is point one, and it is still too fast to catch. Here is one of the captures I could get and magnify. Here is the other. Please let me know what you think this could be and while you're at it, subscribe. I need all the support now to get out there and get these things for you. Before I go though, I just want to say thank you to all my wonderful subscribers and all the people who commented you're all so magnificent. Anyway, I'm going to get started on this week's video now. That comes with a discretion is advice clause. So, remember that. Anyway, I will catch you again on Friday. So, look out for that video. And remember to love yourself and others. I am your host, LT Bartek. Love you. Bye.